Chicken and a two. Oh, you and several million others, man. Now you have to work tomorrow too, or I don't I don't know how how the stores do that. I, I know you have to work some Saturdays, but surely you don't have to work every Saturday. I'm going to try to remember tonight. I'm going to get some pineapple juice at the store. Wow, Wednesday. Damn, you got about four or five days left. Shit. <laughs> Which I'm sure I don't have to remind you of that. You probably, you probably got it down to the minute how long you got left. <laughs> I felt really bad that night we bought our home and everything. We kept that guy. The store was supposed to close at like 9 o'clock. We kept him in there till like 10, 10 30, getting everything set up. He was there about an hour extra. He had to set two telephones up, he had to set the hum up. He had to, then we got the bows, which the bows was pretty simple. That was just hand us the box. Yeah, he, he, he told us about the same thing. But I told the wife, it was nice of him. I know, he was like anybody else. He wanted to get the hell out of there. And we waited way, way, way too late. Which actually, we wouldn't have been that bad, but we kept, if we just went for the phone like we were supposed to be going for, but we kept adding shit. Well, we'll buy this, we'll buy that, we'll get this, we'll get that. And we kind of wasn't I guess from his wallet standpoint, we were great customers, but we were very unorganized. So I guess you guys get paid based on what you sell. Um, if that's the case, he certainly racked up off our unorganized experience. We got the home, we got the old ladies Galaxy 7. Yeah, we, uh, oh, he had a great night. We got the home. We got the Galaxy 7 for the old lady. Then we got the Bose. We got my LG phone. So we bought two telephones, a Bose speaker, and the home. So yeah, he had a pretty good night. Uh, if they fixed it right. Oh, there we go. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we uh we bought a right good bit of stuff from that cat. 
We saw him one day last week. The wife had to go in there for some little something. And he waited on us again. Told him we were we weren't gonna keep him quite as late this time. We just needed I forget I forget what it was we went in there for. Can't remember. I think she wanted a headset or something. I don't I don't I don't remember. I didn't even go in. I sat out in the car with the dog. Um, but yeah, he racked up on us that night back in April. We told the wife when he saw us coming he probably thought oh shit I'm gonna be in here all night again but uh, we was in and out she was in and out that day I can't remember what the hell she went for Something for her phone. She's always buying shit for her phone. Um, she sees something on TV for her phone. She's got to have it. You know, I feel like an idiot. I've had this weeder now for a week. And I just realized that it actually plants stuff. You can put seeds in it. I thought this was all it did. I'm glad. I'm, I'm hoping I hell that when they fix the next patch, when they put the next patch out. I hope they don't fix this. I like this extra round of fertilizer you can get out of it. This is one glitch I hope they never fix. Yeah, this one says it'll plant grass and it'll plant I'm guessing that's probably those damn radishes. I I didn't realize that. I had been looking on the other harvest, other sowers, trying to figure out how you planted those radishes. I thought I was going to have to buy another sewing machine. Hell, I didn't know this one did it. Yep, I've never planted the radishes. My buddy Hollander told me it was pretty useless to point them, plant them right now because due to the glitch, you can get two rounds out of this weeder without having to plant them. So I started doing this. Not really planted any radishes yet. Honestly, I didn't know how until today. Now that Chris is going to be around once in a while, I'm up. I might go ahead and buy a field to plant grass in. And we'll start doing some round bell silage. I'm not going to risk the silos until they get that fixed. That's, it's terrible on PlayStation. I've probably saw 500 complaints about the silage. Oh, 
Okay, uh, apparently the one I have, I just got the little one. I thought, I goofed up. When I first got the game, I didn't realize um, flowers would fertilize too. So I bought the same um, sewing machine that I had in 15. It doesn't. And it don't fertilize either, which pisses me off. So now that I know about that gimmick, I think I wasted my money on the sewer. Gotta break down part of some of this money and buy a new tractor. These these little bitty ones just getting on my nerves. The game ate his scorpion king. How the hell did it do that? How? Just disappear? Fall through the map? What? What the hell? Yeah. What? What does that mean? I'm. I know what it means. It. How did the game eat it though? You know, I know what it means. It, it means how the pissed off as hell because that Scorpion King is his pride and joy, but I'm not sure what you mean by it ate it. Oh, fuck. Is he still mad? <laughs> Cause I know he was mad as hell. You'd you'd have to know Hollander fools. He's a he's a logging freak. That that Scorpion King boy. A weird number appears. That would be an error message. Yeah, if you want to now, full, um, oh, it says the helper just completed his task. I didn't know I had a helper. Oh, he's, okay, well. That's good. I'm, I know how much that damn Scorpion King means to him, which that is a lot of money. Hopefully it's going to come back. That's like I say, fools, that's just another joy of being on PlayStation 4. Uh, they're, they're killing us, man. They really need to do a patch for nothing but PlayStation 4. So, it's really out of control. I'd have had to have complained, but at least complained to Johnson about it. Okay. <laughs> 